cave cow is a cryptid reported from Central Afri- America's Yukon Peninsula, Pe- mainly Bel- Belize, described as hairy animal and shape of a lizard. E.T. Evan T. Sanderson suggested, and Del A. Duran agrees that it may be a living ground sloth. Cave cows are described by Malayan people as lizard shaped animals covered in hair about 10 inches long, which, according to their name, lived in caves. Gain's animal had shaggy black hair and white mane. The animal which attacked Joe was powerful, capable of shaking a large kunum palm and had three large claws. Frank Delurex or Thomas Gain believed it may have been feeding on the palm berries. Blainanex's animal was reported from a lesk of soil great grass savannah and West Virginia virgin forest and also lived in a cave. Sightings, 1890s. According to archaeologist Thomas Gain, 19, 1867, to 1868, French naturalist Francis Frank Blanc at NX, 1951 to 1923, his servant Joe had a fatal encounter with a large clawed animal in Belize near El Guerrero shortly before Belize retired. While resting in a remote savanna during a calm, windless day, Bernalix sent Joe to investigate periodically swaying canoe palm in a wooden thicket, only to hear the man shriek in agony shortly afterwards. Rushing into the thicket, he found him severely mauled by what Joe called the old devil himself, which he said ripped him up before running into the bush. After Joe died of his injuries, Bernalix sent Better day following the creature's pretty obvious trail through the savannah, virgin forest, and a dry riverbed. Before coming to the cave, we discovered clear tracks almost exactly like the thumb and two forefingers of a giant, gigantic human hand, each digit armed with a giant claw. Intended to return during the daytime, but X tried retracing her steps but become lost, and made his way back to El Cleo. After a few days, he and his party of men attempted to find a cave, but unable to, to, the region was literally honeycombed with caves and covered with dense virgin bush. 1932, Gain, leading a British museum expedition into the Alzell River, a tributary of the Hindu River, which forms the border between Mexico's Quintero Root State and Belize, glimpsed a large animal, black shaggy hair fur, a white mane which obscured his, its face, running through a swampy region on all fours like an ape. 2015, a pair of tourists honeymooning in the Belize wrote to the phantoms and monsters in 2015, claiming to have had a near encounter with the then their guide called a cow near Zen X and Ant Ten Zik. They never saw the animal only some trees being pushed about as this thing moved through the thick vegetation but estimated it must have been very large. Ian T. Sanderson ferritized the cave cows with medium sized ground sloths, consistent of heavy description of heavy, heavy lizard shaped bodies and cave dwelling habitats. While Gain is said to believe the animal he saw in a zoo with a, resembled a ground sloth. A number of medium sized ground sloths are known from the late Pinastine Yakakan, including the epid- don't do many more. Carl Sine Silker writes that the tracks of an animal which killed Joe, the injuries inflicted upon a dead man, were consistent with a medium sized ground sloth identity. Conclusion 
also supported by Richard Freeman with a covered hat. The story may simply have been a traveller's tale.